Hey, you know, what is up my magic malcontents risen dragon here with probably one of the first times that we've done this, a combo deck. Now, you might be saying, well, well, dragon, you do a lot of stuff that has like synergies and stuff like that. This is a straight up, I think, kind of combo deck. And once more, I got the idea from Mono Black Magic, who did his uh, thing today where he made like billions of copies of uh, Jenga Taxis and just kind of went to town on the person. Uh, but this one is, I think, a little more devious. Okay, and let me explain why. Okay, this card right here, Vesuvan Dip Duplomancy. Whenever you cast a spell that targets only a single artifact or creature you control, create a token that's a copy of that artifact or creature, except it's not legendary. Okay, see where we're going with this? Shieldred, the Apocalypse. What's better than having one Shieldred on the board? Many Shieldreds on the board. Okay, we make copies of Shieldred to basically just try to just basically drain our opponent every time they, they draw a card. This is just a devious, devious deck if we can pull it off. So how do we pull it off? Well, luck. That's part of it. But also, too, we have a bunch of other cards that we can go with. Okay, we have Lantern Bearer, basically this one. It's a flyer, but yet when it dies, it goes back to the graveyard if... It would be put into a graveyard from anywhere, exile it instead, and but we can play it for its disturb cost, and it uh, gives our creature flying uh, uh, plus, and plus one, plus one. Shore up just protects our creatures, gives us plus one and hexproof. Slip out the back, put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature. It phases out. Tamio safekeeping. Gains indestructible until end of turn. We gain two life. We have some uh, phasing out with March of Swirling Mist and uh, some spot removal with March of the Wretched Sorrow. Storm Chaser Drake is kind of a cog in this deck because we have to make sure that we are getting, you know, you know this one. We got to draw cards. Okay, we got to draw into cards and we have to make sure that uh, we're getting the lands that we need. So we are only running. I think 16 creatures. No, no. Yes, yes. Uh, 14 creatures total in this deck. So this is going to be a big one. We're also going to do fake our own death. Basically, till end of turn, target creature gets plus two, plus zero, and gains when this creature dies. Return it to the battlefield tapped under its owner's control, and you create a treasure token. We are playing Ivy Gleeful Spell Thief. Whenever a player casts a spell that targets only a single creature other than Ivy, Gleeful Spell Thief, you may copy that spell. The copy targets Ivy. See where we're going with this? This with the Duplomancy? Insane. We are also running Meat Hook Massacre just for some mass removal. Yeah, we're kind of jamming it in there, but, you know, we do want to keep some threats. We don't want to keep as many threats off the board as possible. Sideboard, we have Infernal Grasp, Spot Removal, Bouncers Beat Down in case we're up against any black permanents, black creatures and stuff. We're more March of Swirling Mists. We're also running some Outland Liberators and uh, some Broken Wings in case we come up against Flyers. So, it does this deck work? Is it competitive? I, I don't know, but it's a ton of fun to play. Um, it's frustrating at times. This is going to be a work in progress, I think. Uh, but we're in bronze, so we can kind of take these chances without taking major hits to our rating. Uh, for those of you that are new to my channel, we do a best of one, and then we do a best of three, just so you can see how this deck functions in uh, those environments. So without further ado, let's see how we do. Let's get to the games. We're against Irony Man. I like that name, Irony Man. Uh, okay, well, we've got the combo. Now can we get it down? Can we get the mana for it? Maybe. These, this could get interesting, folks. We can do this. And all we need is to draw into that third land, a fourth land. And we put down the diplomacy, diplomacy. Okay, this works. Uh, we can't quite put down the spell thief quite yet, but that's fine because what we can do is we put this down. Oh, no, we can't. So we put that down, and then we might be able to make something with this, though. Ooh, Storm Chaser Drake is a good one at the moment. Um, let's just put down the spell thief and see what they do. Uh, we'll at least get them to draw, and the duplomancy will come down, and then... In theory, oh come on! Tell me you're not running counter magic. Yeah, well, they'll draw a card. I'm I'm okay with that. Have your opponent draw a card. Uh, yeah, take action. Yeah, so I'm okay with that. 
Uh, Kaito. Okay. Well, this will... There are many secrets I don't know. This will, uh, put this down. We draw into another land, and we're in, we're in pretty decent shape. We're down to another land in really, really good shape. We're drawn to a land, and they tap out, and we're in good shape. Okay, they have a sheltered themselves, so that's okay. Um, cause, yeah, take action, I'll have them draw a card. And they gain life, I'm okay with that. They'll draw a card again, they'll gain more life. Yeah, that's okay. So, that's fine. Okay, uh, they gain more life. Yes! <laughs> Here we go. Alright, ready? Boom. We're doing this. We are doing this, folks. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ready? Ready, ready? Here we go. Boom. Shore up. We create that spell. We copy it. We do that. Boom. Boom. Ah! Yes! Oh, yes! We're doing it! We are doing it! Yes! <laughs> oh, this is worth the price of admission right here. Alright, this is worth the price of admission. Now, just don't destroy him. That's the only thing. Alright, don't destroy him. Because, yeah, I got more where that came from. I have way more than that came from. Alright, absolutely. Way more where that came from. Come on, buddy, what are we doing? What are we doing here? This is a fun deck. If when, when this deck pops, it is fun as all heck. This is fun. Okay. All right. What are they doing? So I think we're gonna take the damage. We're gonna take the damage. We're not gonna block. I am totally fine with that. You're gonna destroy it. Invoke despair. Okay. Uh. Oh, nuts, but we gotta... Ah, dang it. Alright, well... That's okay. It's okay. Ah, I should've kept the... Should've kept the copy. Oh, well. Maybe we can draw into it again. Maybe we can draw into it again. Alright, so... Uh, it balances out, though. So... To an extent. What are they thinking here? So, okay. Well, what, 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 what's your what's your plan? One, two, three. Okay, yeah, they did that. All right. All right. So that's okay. Gain life and then gain it back. Okay. Just down. Down storm chips are great. And then we can do this. Simply so we can... Alright. And... Boom. Okay. Well, I learned what I needed to. Because here's what's going to happen. No blocks, but yet I can't... Why did I... Huh? Why couldn't I phase him out? <sighs> Alright. Should have gone full control there. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. 
Because I think what they do now is I think we're dead because they've got the the invoke to invoke to spare. So um, I think we're pretty much dead here. Ah, um, meat hook. All right. Well, why can I not? Oh, I don't have that. Oh man, that's why. Uh. All right. Well, good game. At least you got to see what it's like to have multiple shieldreds on the field. All right, let's go to the best of three. We are against Solopsa for our best of three matchup. Now, again, this deck I don't think is really designed to be competitive. It's just designed to be fun. I mean, who doesn't like having multiple shieldreds on the field? And you saw we can get it done. You know, and I think against slower decks... This deck definitely can uh, it can can do some damage. Absolutely, it can. So, if Mr. Saul here will. Uh, kindly pass priority and, and if we can figure out what's going on. Uh, this is not the greatest. Uh, I don't think we keep this. The only reason is, is we don't really have much to go with this. This is okay. Given the luck that we've had though, also some really slow lands here. But that being said, we do have the mass removal, so that might not be a bad thing. Um, you know what? We're going to keep it, just for the heck of it. Let's see what happens. Put down the Rafines. Uh, alright, well, not going to get a ton out of this this hand right now, so... Let me put this down, and then put down a... Okay, we're against Demir. Maybe ninjas? Yep, ninjas. Alright, well... Okay, we have the Duplomancy. So, we got that going on. So I think this is a ninja's build. And honestly, we get that down. Kaito. Okay. So they'll attack. I could Drop. Right by, okay. But I'm Boom. To fight. Okay. Yeah, this could be a tough matchup for us, but that's okay. He phases out, so that's fine. Uh, let's do this. Let's do... March of Wretched Sorrow. Just do one. Not gonna see, not gonna do that. Um, gain our life back. We're okay there. Boom. Put down the Duplomancy and see what they do. Okay. It's That's like fine. your defenses aren't even there. That's fine for now. Silver for the master. So you're gonna be real sad next turn, my friend. Well, my friend, you're gonna be real sad next turn, I say. So I'm gonna meet her here. I'm gonna meet her here. Whoop. There we go. Okay. Well, there we go, good shot. I say, I say, I say. Alright, well, here we go. Actually, this would be a fun con. That'd be a really fun one right there. Ooh, what's this? Okay. Hills combat damage to a player. Okay, so they're dude, they're fishing There's right no now. Secret I can't uncover. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, they did play that. Alright, well, here's what we do. Let's put this down right here. Let's don't not cycle that. Let's put this down. Let's go down the top card of each player's library until end of turn. Oh, that's devious. That is devious and not devious indeed. Indeed. Very devious. Not very devious. Silver Fur Master. Okay. Oh, they found my March of Swirling Mist, huh? Well then. That's, that kind of stinks, but, yeah, what can you do? What can you do, huh? All right, there's that, and that gets exiled. Okay. Cool. Reality chip, huh? 
equipment jellyfish. I love it. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do Ivy. Um, in turn, we might be able to do some fun stuff here. They're targeting that, obviously. So... Okay. Alright, they didn't they dis they discard, so Okay, we get that. Now reality chip. Okay, they're gonna reconfigure that. That's okay. Here's what we do. We're gonna cycle this. See what we get. Okay, shore up's okay. I like that. Um, so it gains indestructible. Okay, another... Ooh, that's devious. Um, yeah, that's really bad. But let's see what we got here. Alright, we're not going to let them... Pass to blockers, we're going to do this. Boom. And now... Tommy knows. We can create a copy of that. They're going to do Fading Hope. Okay, well... Even still, that comes down as a copy. It's not legendary, but even still, boom. Do this. Now watch, we do this. That's fun. No attacks. So now we got all these creatures down. All these ivies. Okay. Well then, uh, we're gonna pass to the blockers. We're gonna block that because I don't want anything like ninjutsu-y coming down. So we're gonna do this and we're gonna do this. And put uh, that. Gain some. <laughs> okay, they just. They just did that. Okay, well, maybe the Ivy and the Duplomancy work. Uh, maybe. We will see what happens. Let's go to our... Let's go to this one right here. I think they were just waiting for us to, like... You know, the, the, the Tommy of Safekeeping kind of saved our butts that time. So, hey, at least we got a win out of that. How would it... How, 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 how cool would it be if we hit silver with this? hit silver with this absolutely janky build that I threw together. I was sitting in my yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a uh, I'm a middle school teacher and I'm sitting in like my lunch period. Just like envisioning this deck and I'm thinking to myself, how can I make this work? How can this I'm going to keep this. Uh, we don't have the duplomancy, but we sure as heck have our storm chaser and our lantern bearer and a shora. Uh, so we're gonna put that on Lantern Bear just so we can uh, do that. Shore up will give us hexproof. Fighting Palm Ninja, how fun is that? <laughs> Here's a Duplomancy. Okay, well, uh, I think we put down the Drake. And we're not going to do anything at the moment. Because what we do is we... This has Manas. It has Manas. And... Uh, this reveals... It. Yeah, so we don't want that coming through. But also at the same time, we only have, like, these two creatures. Kaito. Okay. Well, here's another option, too. We could phase this Get out. out. Easy mission. Yeah, we're going to phase this out. Uh, shore up, I'm going to phase out, but we're going to phase that out. <laughs> okay, Rathene's Tower. We're going to do this. Put down the Duplomancy. No attacks. That was kind of short-sighted on me. 
Because this will now come in in... Well, no. Because if they get rid of the... If they get rid of the, the Tamiyo, then I think we're okay. I'm okay if they get rid of that at the moment. They'll they'll cycle something through here. Uh, no blocks. They they'll ninjutsu a few things here. I I guarantee it. That gets ninjutsu. Yep. A oh, thousand face shadow. That's always cool. Boom. Oof. Yeah, that's that's bad. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. No, that's that's okay right there. Can't exile can't exile lands, but that's all right. So you can grab that. The downside is we don't have the danged green source. That helps. Uh, Cause what we can do now is this. Boom. Do that. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool. Uh. I think we do this. Let's just do that. Boom. And yeah. All right. Might be in a little bit of business here. Because uh, what will happen here is Lantern Bearer will will die. Um, we are going to take a little bit of damage though. That's that right there. Boom. We're just gonna block. We'll take f take that. They'll ninjutsu something in. I'm okay with that. And this is just more like a demo purposes only sort of thing. So what they'll probably do is filter that out. Moon Circuit Hacker. Oh, okay. That's cool. Now they'll filter in the... Uh, they'll, they'll not filter in, but they'll ninjutsu that in. And then that comes down. Boom. They'll remove the card there. And uh, they draw a card. So basically those get... get thrown away. Yeah. Alright, one of those gets thrown away. Oh, okay, cool. That could work. Um, so what we're gonna do is no attacks. No attacks. Uh, are we dead? We might be dead. I'm gonna be dead here. Uh, so here's what we do. We're gonna block this and block this. And now they'll come down with the biting palm. Trade off something here. Okay. We're going to slip out the back. Gonna draw a card. Okay. We're going to fake our own death. Just simply so we can get the uh One target creature to its own sand. Okay. So we can't quite do that. That's alright though. Okay. Okay. If we get a meat hook, we're in we're in good shape. Okay. Well, unfortunately for us, um, this is not going to work out. But what we can do is this. Let's try this. Of course. Of course. Yeah. Alright. Not to... Not what we were expecting. We did grab it. We, we just kind of ran out of gas there. Um, 
The bouncer's beat down, I have to wonder if that is going to be an option here, because... <sighs> Certainly. It's all right, though. Nah, I think we're all set with this. Boom. I think we're okay there. All right. Let's see what we got. And tonight's kind of a fun video, just to show you kind of like what we can do with, with, with these... Uh, let's see that. Yeah, I'll keep that. Maybe because we do have Lantern Bear, and then we do have the Tomios. Um, just so we can... Well, yeah, that may have been pretty mature of me. But, yeah, we'll do this. What did he not draw into? Okay. That helps a little bit. Okay. Well, let's do Storm Chaser Drake. I haven't seen any spot removal from them. So, I think... We do have a meat hook as well, but we need that second black source. Alright, uh, so, so, okay, they're pondering here. Oh, maybe they do have spot, okay, they do have spot removal. Alright, well, that stinks. Okay, well, I guess we just go with Lantern Bearer. And we go from there. Reality chip, huh? Okay. Well, good stuff. Okay. Alright. We don't want to put down the meat hook because. Nor do I think we want to block. Nor do I think we want to attack in. Definitely don't think we attack in. attack. We do not attack here. Death touch and lifelink, huh? Well then. Uh, cool. Oh, I thought for sure they would attack there. For sure they would attack. Uh, ooh, Ivy. She's fun. Maybe. You're still gonna do that. You're kidding me, right? Ugh. All right. Well, so much for that. That's okay though, because we just blocked the Nazumi Prowler. Boom. We just block that, and Ivy will come down. In theory. So that comes. That gets bounced. Biting palm. Okay. So what are they choosing here? Do not take my ivy. 
Take the meat hook. Yes, thank you. That's fine. Let's take my shattered. Boom. Boom. <laughs> uh, groovy. Okay. Now it just got interesting. Satoru Umazawa. Okay. Well then. We draw a card. Boom. Uh, we are going to play Ivy. So we do have that option right now. We are also going to play this. <laughs> Am I getting greedy? Yes, I am getting very greedy. I really don't care. A flying shieldred? How cool is that? Right there. We're just going to sit here on this, I think, for the moment. Each creature card in your hand doesn't enjoy. Yeah, that's a scary card. I admit, that does scare me. And did I get greedy with the lantern lift? Yeah, probably. But we've got a pretty big board. And, uh, yeah, they're going to do something here. Moon Snare Specialist. Oh, fun. Well, that stinks. Okay. Well, that's alright. That's alright. I knew I got greedy there. That, that's my fault. But that's okay. Had to try it. Yeah. There you go. Oh. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You know what? And just for the heck of it, we're gonna do this. Uh, no attacks. As long as they don't have a biting palm ninja, I think we're okay. If we get another land, that would be really cool. Just so we could get, like, a shieldred down and then a fake your own death. Even if it doesn't do anything. Or even if we get, like, a, a sneak out the back. Okay, ah, dang it. Oh. Well. Well, actually, that kind of worked, because they did the uh, Infernal Grasp twice, and it cost them some life. Now, of course, they're going to... Well, they can't do that. All right, so they can't... All right. Ninjutsu, okay, well. All right. No worries there. The Dokuchi Silencer. Boom. I don't have any creatures, so... Ready? Be afraid. Be very afraid. I don't even care if this does nothing. Okay, now they draw... Boom. Okay. Okay, we're gonna block this. We're gonna block this. So something's coming down. Probably another Dakuchi silencer. Oh, okay, that's fun. Boom. Alright, so she comes in. Alright, that didn't do you much. So. Did we just win? No, because they've got that. Okay, that's okay. Storm Chase of Drake. So we gained life out of that. Boom. And now, we swing. This is fatal. If they don't block, this is fatal damage. And now they're dead. They are dead. We just killed them. Oh my gosh, it worked! That's crazy. That just worked. That is crazy that we just won with this deck. We just won a best of three with this deck. That is crazy. 
That's absolutely nuts. Let's go to the postmortem. I'm psyched. Okay, so there is potential for this deck to get absolutely nuts with Vesuvan Diplomacy, Duplomancy, and Shieldred on the board. But you also saw that it can get pretty nuts even with Ivy and Storm Chaser on the board too. So just a really, really, really quirky but yet just insanely fun deck to play if you can figure out a way to play around it. There's just a lot of mechanics that have to come together, and it's just really, really... You know, it takes some patience to play this. Is it competitive? I don't think it is. But you know what? Who cares? This is a fun build. I love it. I love experimenting. This is definitely the type of deck that I like to play. But if I can get it a little more consistent, then great. Hopefully Mono Black Magic will be proud of me at some point. But anyways, I really hope you like this video. If you did like this video, leave a like, leave a subscribe. As always, my magic miscreants, may all your draws be godlike. May all your spells hit the board. Risen Dragon is out. Enjoy the rest of your evening.